So, Andrew, we just got finished talking about gold being at all-time highs mm -hmm. and some of the gold that people should be buying. I thought it would be a good idea to talk about the, the stuff that people should stay clear of. What do you think? Uh, I, got you okay? some, I got some right here. All right, well, guys, <laughs> we're going to get into this coming right up. There's a pile of gold on your desk. You've got your... Uh, scrap jewelry over yeah. there. Little mix of everything. Little mix of everything. We talked about some of the different coins. We talked about some of the pre-33, but I noticed you had made a comment. You said, I don't know what the F is up with this type of gold. and The worst. What gold <laughs> is the worst and These, why? You know, we were just talking about coins that go into the melt. That one's going right into my melt. Oh, my God, guys. And what a shame, because it's made by the U.S. Mint. It's in a beautiful box. Comes with a nice presentation. But what a... Shitty coin. Uh, no <laughs> other way to Bush, no way to, other way to put it. Barbara Bush and who do we got here? Uh, Edith Wilson. Uh, beautiful coin, but gone right in the melted. I think like the box is what. It's beautiful. Is nice the, presentation. And the you know, coin itself, I mean, it's nice coin. Nice just, coin, man, but just you know, I couldn't resell one of these if my life depended on it. What you know? is it that? These also. What is it? Five dollar commemoratives. Oh, just, is this like Olympics? Just, just and... not a good coin. They come out with a new one every year, and very low premium. But what the hell is this national park release? Yeah. U.S. vault collection. So, do people just collect these because of the low premium, right? Yeah, because of the low premium. I'm pretty sure they come oh, out with a new one every year. They come with a, a silver a, constitution coin. It comes sometimes. with a one dollar U.S. Yes. commemorative and a five dollar gold commemorative. Yes, comes in those in those boxes. Yes, yeah, same thing. Nice presentation made by the U.S. Mint, but. Reselling just tough on it. I don't think I've ever had anyone call and ask for five dollar commemoratives. I think you these know. types of products are the products that you see on like QVC, QVC, yeah. or Good not even on like I saw the other day like Fox Business or whatever had some infomercials on there where they were selling just like some of the cheesiest stuff. They're like, look at these presidential no, sets that's how and they get blah, them. blah blah blah. Yeah, yeah. They're like. And I was pricing, because as a dealer, like, you know how much things go for, and so you start pricing things out in your head, just how much the markup is, and you know that oh there's God. older people at home, like, thinking, what a great opportunity this is, yeah, yeah. and they just paid, like, double, triple what these things should go for. I have never once purchased any of those presidential dollars, commemoratives I've never purchased, I think they're dogs. I've, I, I wonder how they sell for the U.S. Mint. They, keep, they made a whole series of them. So, I'm willing to bet that that line of product or that is going to continue to like go by the wayside. I feel like because wouldn't you think that is there a Melania Trump one? I don't think so. That's true. No, Michelle not Obama. Yet. I don't no. think so. See, but I just don't. I don't know which people would be out there buying those right now. I mean, half of the like I said, community these, is at even least these. Is, these probably going to get cracked out of here and and thrown in my melt. Thrown in the melt. Yeah. And and you can't even sell that at like spot. I get I, I get paid be, so close to spot that like it wouldn't be worth, worth my it. time to break it out of there. Right. You know. Right. So I people, couldn't like I said I couldn't get ten twenty dollars. If it, I can get ten twenty dollars over, I'd try and sell them. But even that to get that ten extra dollars, it could sit for weeks on my website. Do you, you think know? people looking to buy cheap gold should even bother buying this stuff, or should they just buy different types? Yeah, of if cheap you're looking gold, to buy like, cheap gold, you know. It's definitely an option, but you know you got to remember when you resell it, it's yeah. going to be worth less than its melt value. Yeah. Right now, anyway. Well, you also get the comments too, of um, you know people talking about. <sighs> God, they're just they're just saying like, you know, people that are buying gold below spot, like dealers, like for so you for example, or me, or other dealers, they're like. You know, if somebody's offering below spot, you're ripping them they're, off. Rip, they're scammers. Yeah, that's and the stuff. way the market is right now, unfortunately. It hit all time highs. And, I, and, you know, I know the suppliers are all having the same issue. People just not buying. Right. You know, and right. Uh, what ha then the only thing they, they can do is lower the premiums to yeah. try to move them. And, like you said, they're selling Krugerrands for $6. spot plus $6. Right. You know, you're talking uh, a quarter of a percent. You, you know what I mean? It's, uh, you know, it's nothing. There is nothing. And I try to explain to these people. I think I text messaged you the picture of the comments. I'm like, these people just don't have a flipping clue. They and I want to tell you, if, if a dealer like me is paying, you know, 99% or $10 under, a local coin shop, 
is paying fifty dollars under. Yeah. You know, it's uh yeah. They have to make money on it too. They're they're counting on the retail customers coming in, right. whereas you Which it probably ain't happening. Not a them, lot. You know. Not a lot. Yeah, guys, I mean I I've never I've had two hundred nearly two hundred and fifty auctions. Um do the math, what is it? Almost like five years worth, right? One a week, that's a lot. Never sold these things <laughs> they are just they are just not good products if you want them for whatever weird reason it's just to me it's also so random like i wouldn't even be buying like presidents of the united states let alone first, first lady. ladies yeah you know what would you and and then yeah the commemorative stuff where it's like the olympics like 1988 olympics of blah 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 it says it doesn't make any sense um so the cheaper options then in that case like if you're really looking to go bottom of the barrel dirt cheap sort of thing then go with the bars like andrew always says what's this that's a uh, one ten ounce cougar yeah, ring. That's, that's what i thought it was um yeah i just thought it was funny and for you you know you're just you'll crack them you melt them into a bar they get put right in here with this a, just in, in the with the scrap jewelry you know right now yep how much Scrap jewelry, would you say that is? Uh, it's probably like hundred, hundred twenty-five thousand here, probably. I kept probably another thirty here. What about that world is yours? Medallion? Oh yeah, man. I'm gonna put that up on my website. Let's see if anybody uh, put in the comments below. Do you even know what this is from? You know what? This is pretty cool. The world is yours. What's that? That's Caesar? a replica of a Roman coin. That's pretty cool. Pendant, fourteen karat gold. Why don't you get one of your head with like the laurel and the, <laughs> the crown? Not sure there. anybody will buy it. <laughs> no, you would do it for yourself. Wear it for myself. Yeah, eh, I got enough charms on here. <laughs> I just had a new one made. I can see how it gets addicting because I have the one now, and I'm like, I don't want a charm, but you'll have a charm on it eventually, man. Uh, was... Or another chain. You look like a two chain kind of guy. Uh, that's what I, I don't know what I'm. Supposed... What that's supposed to mean? You said I'm a rope chainer. Yeah, rope chain what? kind of guy. <laughs> <laughs> um, I might do a second one, but you know, already like you know, my wife like looked at it. It was like kind of just it's different like, to never be wearing one for 20 years and all of a sudden have chained. one. Yeah. It's like, wait, who are you? You know what I mean? <laughs> um, I'm not opposed. I was looking at that other one, that you know, that one With that the diamond class. Diamond class. Oh, check there. you out, man. <laughs> Classy. No, yeah, I don't know. but. We'll see. I don't know. I feel like I need something a little bit more solid. Let me see the thing. Let me see the one. This one, right? Yeah. Is that it? That's it, man. Nice. But this one's like very similar it's to the one I already have. Yeah. So, like, wouldn't that look weird having two the same length of the same sort you look, of... You look a lot cooler, man. <laughs> I'll tell you. You're just trying to push it on me now because you can make six dollars. <laughs> you can make a whole six bucks on this. And I was able to, guys, if you didn't see the episode of Andrew almost punching me in the throat, being unable to work the class, but I was able to do this one. Without, this one's easy. Without, it is, compared child to the other proof. one. It's a child. <laughs> child and Matt proof. Um, but, uh, come know, on, don't mess it up on camera. There, there we go. go. I just gave it old, uh, an old tug there. But, yeah, I don't know. It's, it's nice. Is it? like? I mean, this is a man's. Men's, dude. Put it on. No, I'm not putting it on right now. <laughs> I'm not putting it on right now. He really wants me to wear it out. I can't wear two of these things. It's like, I don't know, I'll consider it. And I'm still considering a ring, but I don't know quite to that extent, but yeah, I'm man. still considering one. But I, I appreciate you at least backing me up on, on those because I think they're a terrible product too. And I was it, excited when I saw the box. I thought they were bo uh, proof buffaloes. Yeah, I was like, yeah, oh, yeah. nice, man. And proof I seen it. buffalo boxes are bigger than that. I said, oh, man, as a spouse coins. Proof bu buffalo boxes are larger, and they have, like, the magnetic uh, thing in the front, like, where you pop it there, and it kind of, right. like, props open, like, it yeah, just stays yeah, up. Yep. Yeah. President. Presidential <laughs> ladies. But anyhow, <laughs> hey, bud, I appreciate the yeah, time. Yeah, good seeing you. You too, bud.